brother's getting so big. Monkey? Ooh, ooh, ha, ha. sitting at the table playing with their blocks and it reminded me of this video I have of Emma when she was probably a little bit older, closer to two, but it was when the boys were babies and she was doing the same thing. She was building her blocks up on the table and then using her little toy animals and playing with the animals in the blocks and I just can't believe they are that big now where they're sitting at the table like little big boys and playing with their blocks. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> the weather today is super funky and overcast. I actually shared on Instagram, but I got this really scary yet funny clip of Skelly this morning. Early, early, early when it was still dark outside. but I gotta get back inside because Asher is not happy that he thinks I left. Okay, wait. Ow! I hate I out! You wanna show everyone your fort? Well, I like the video Soviet Grandma. What song do you wanna listen to? Uh, freeze Dance. Party Freeze Dance? Yeah. Hey Google, play the Party Freeze Dance song. The Party Freeze Dance song, 2014 version. You ready? Yeah. Sure. Shall I go on your moves? Yeah. You got some good moves. Okay, ready? <laughs> You guys may not have been able to tell, but we are having an emotional morning here. You wanna come up? Ruben's trying to climb up so he can be up here with us. Okay, ready? One, two, three. There we go. <laughs> Look at how proud he is. I know. Come on, do you need ibuprofen yet? <laughs> no, okay. So Justin and I made a decision this morning and it's it's time. We're going to start the process of taking Bye. away the boys' pacifiers. I went back and watched some of the videos from when we started the process of taking Emma's pacifier away, which she was a little bit older. She was 22 months old when we took hers away. They are 18 months old today, right? Is today the 23rd? I think they're 18 months old today. I am much more terrified of taking away the pacifiers from these boys than I was with Emma. Just simply for the fact that there are two of them and they can react completely different. I don't know how they're going to react. But we started the process doing the same thing that we did for Emma, which is they don't really use them during the day anymore, but we're gonna be much more strict on that starting now. What we did with Emma was for like a week straight, we said no pacifiers except for at nap time and at bedtime. So they only get them at nap time and bedtime. And then with Emma, what we did was we like slowly reduced the amount of pacifiers that we put in their crib. I don't know if anyone can understand a word I'm saying between all of the kids up here on the table. <laughs> We're gonna slowly reduce the amount of pacifiers that we put in the crib with them because they usually sleep with like three or four pacifiers, but we're gonna take them away one by one, which is what we did with Emma, and replace it with like a lovey or something that they can become attached to. Emma became attached to this little bobo 
I don't know what they're gonna become attached to. They're, they're a lot younger than she was. Not a lot younger, but four months is like a pretty significant difference as far as development goes. So I have no idea how they're going to react, but it's not going great during the day. They are very attached and emotional, but they have always been much more like mama's boys than Emma ever was. <laughs> so I'm terrified, but I think it's time. We've been honestly talking about doing it, but um, the boys got sick. We had a lot of traveling in September and all of that. So we kind of kept on putting it off. I think now is like a good time. Plus I think it'll be good for his teeth and speech and his speech as well to just nix them now. We regretted doing it so late because right when we did it with her, she had become so attached to them. Remember, yeah. there were a few months before that when we did it where she didn't really care for them. Yeah. And we could have done it then and it would have been a little easier. I remember she saying that. She <laughs> was so attached when we finally did it. And so we don't want that to happen with the boys. We want to do it at a good time before. They're like, oh my gosh, I need these. I remember her running around the house going, where'd it go? Cassie, yeah. where yeah. is it? And they're not talking that much yeah. yet. So they're not gonna do that. But it'll be good. It'll be good. I think it'll be really good for their speech as well as teeth and all of that. He loves the camera. You love it. You want me to hold you? Yes? Yes? No. no. <laughs> Do you remember when you were a baby and you had a pacifier? Just like brothers. And you would go, where, where, where's my passy? <laughs> you remember that? You have your pink bobo now, huh? I want a puppy and a kitty. You want a puppy and a kitty, but what should we get for brothers to sleep with? Um, a kitty. A kitty? Maybe they'll like a kitty lovey. We'll have to find something special for them. Brothers getting so big. What are we looking at? Um, some creatures. Some creatures? Yeah. I see some kitties and a vampire dog. He's hiding after he fell over. I'm going to wake the boys up, but I stepped on a Lego. Do you guys see that? It hurt so bad. I did not realize it broke the skin. Now I'm limping. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> They've been doing so much better with their naps since we started putting them down later. By the way, bless you. See, this is the problem with the passies. You guys see this? One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Can you drop it? Can you drop the passy? Drop the passy. Drop it. Drop it. Yeah, good job. See it? <laughs> oh, kisses. What about brother? Say kisses. Kisses. He's like, so Mom, cute. I'm still waking up. Come oh, on. So Let's go get a snack. You want a snack? Uh, say yes. Uh, yes. Yes. He doesn't say yes. He says, uh-huh. 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 Uh -huh. <laughs> Watch your feet. I know. <laughs> that really hurt. I can't believe it was bleeding. You step on toys so hard. <laughs> okay. Snack? Uh-huh. Actually, I think we need to get more snack. I'm pretty sure we are like out of food. I just heard Emma wake up and look what came in the mail literally one minute ago. She is going to be so excited. Her other ones that she got last year, they were unicorns from Target and they were really cute, but I had to toss them because her feet are growing so quickly. They were seven. These are nine, so I'm hoping she has room to grow. Still limping. Oh, are you gonna help me, boys? Asher is sissy. <laughs> Who is that? Mommy got you something in the mail. It's new rain boots. They came in the mail today. Okay. <laughs> They're, guess what color they are? They're purple. <laughs> I want a cupcake too. You want a cupcake? Yeah. You need to eat some food, come on. So we might end up going to someone's house tonight for dinner instead of being here, in which case I need to clean up the house before we go because if you're wondering how I hurt my foot, this is how, you guys see all of these are Legos and little tiny sharp triangle blocks. And before someone else gets hurt, I think I need to pick all of these up, which is gonna take forever. 
You want me to put the blocks in? Put them in. And help mama. Yeah, you make this mess. Put them in. Okay, here is a prime example of how Ruben is so smart when it comes to electronics. How long did it take me to figure out how to airplay? I don't even think you know how to do it. I might not. I just looked up at the TV and this kid has figured out how to mirror my phone image onto the TV and he's looking at pictures of himself and Asher on my phone and somehow he figured out how to airplay so that it's on the TV now. Like he is such a genius when it comes to phones and electronics. I don't I don't even know how he he's swiping. You are swiping through the photos. Who's that? Who is it? Bobo. Bobo? Ruben, who is that? Bobo. Bobo. Who's that? Who? Sissy. Sissy? Sis. <laughs> Dad, Dad, and Mama. Ruben, who's that? Mama. Mama. Dad, Dad. <laughs> who's that? That's you and Joshua at the pumpkin patch. Come on. No, car, car, car. We're gonna go in the car. Ready? Ready, set, up. Come on, Ruben. Come here. Can I have a hug? <laughs> Good job. Good job. You look so cute. My little pink delicious. Mommy yeah. made a mistake. We forgot we don't have a car seat in your car, so you have to ride with Daddy. Is that okay? Because your car seat is in Daddy's car because we had the car wash. Huh? Oh. I love you. We are going out right now, all five of us. We're going over to Kaylee's house for dinner at her apartment. So we have the car detailed. What was that, like a, a couple days ago, three or four days ago, and we obviously have not gone out much. So I put the boys' car seats back in, but I hadn't put Emma's back in yet, and I totally forgot about it. Anyways, now Justin has to take Emma because it takes too long to switch the car seats to a different car. So I think we'll just do that another day. I got the boys loaded up. They're white. Yeah, we're gonna go to Auntie's house. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna meet us, dear. I'm gonna meet you there, okay? Yeah. I love you. I love you. Yeah. They're actually kind of big on you still, which is good because you keep growing so quickly. Ready? Yeah. I'll Let's see go. you there. Love you. Love you. I'll see you in five minutes. <laughs> it's too long apart. <sighs> Anyways, these kids are about to get mad at me because I'm taking too long. So thank you guys so much for watching, and we will talk to you again next time. Say bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye.